A team used the Karma Array to study the Andromeda Galaxy, yielding critical insights into its molecular cloud system. Astronomers from Cardiff University employed the Combined Array for Research in Millimeter Wave Astronomy, or Karma, to gather this essential data. Molecular clouds are vast reservoirs of interstellar gas and dust, left over from the formation of galaxies, primarily composed of molecular hydrogen. The Andromeda Galaxy, also known as Messier 31, is a barred spiral galaxy with a diameter of about 152,000 light-years and a mass of 1.5 trillion solar masses. Andromeda holds the title of the nearest major galaxy to our own Milky Way. Andromeda's proximity makes it an excellent location to investigate the physical properties of its molecular clouds and star-forming regions. A team led by Gyro Vladimir Armijos Abendano set out to build the largest ever sample of molecular clouds in the Andromeda galaxy. The researchers applied a dendrogram to the Karma data in the position-position velocity space to identify individual clouds. This analysis successfully identified 453 molecular clouds in Andromeda, establishing the largest cloud catalog for this galaxy to date. Additionally, 35 sources showing multiple velocity components, which are considered cloud complexes, were also detected. The study provided detailed measurements regarding the size, mass, and dynamics of these identified molecular clouds. The clouds have a mean radius of about 72 light years and a mean mass of approximately 158,500 solar masses. The calculated velocity dispersion for these clouds is around 2.8 kilometers per second, showing a weak anti-correlation with the galactocentric radius. Crucially, the study found that the mean virial parameter suggests about 66% of the molecular clouds in Andromeda are gravitationally bound. The astronomers then compared these findings to molecular clouds in our own Milky Way galaxy, highlighting significant differences. The size and mass values of the identified Andromeda clouds were compared to those of the Milky Way and other clouds in M31. A key finding is that the mass of the Andromeda clouds does not scale with radius in the same manner as the clouds and cloud complexes in the Milky Way. The scientists concluded that the slope of the size-mass relationship for Andromeda's clouds is notably shallower than that found in our galaxy's clouds and cloud complexes. This new cloud atlas provides invaluable data, significantly deepening our understanding of the star formation processes and molecular cloud systems in the Andromeda galaxy.